Welcome to today's edition of the show podcast. Scott Disick's house is officially on the market. The Keeping Up with the Kardashian star has listed his Hidden Hills, California home for $6.98 million, where he's tried to strike a balance between minimal design and maximum comfort. Hey, race a look inside the sprawling estate, courtesy of Top 10 Real Estate Deals. Calm. Once I was doing my own house, it came back to me and I started remembering all the magazines I used to read, the furniture brands and different eras, DeSick told Architectural Digest about his abode. I was looking for something that felt very East Coast. I always pictured myself in a kind of Hamptons feeling house but updated. I like it to be as minimal as possible but still comfortable. In addition to his time on KUTWK, which is now coming to an end this season, DeSick has also hosted a renovation series titled Flip It Like DeSick, putting his renovation skills on display for the rest of the world to see. The 5,663-square-foot home features five bedrooms, six bathrooms, and a contemporary farmhouse. There's also an open chef's kitchen, two large master suites, and an attached six-car garage. It's also utilized plenty of reclaimed wood for the pool pavilion and entertainment lounge area that leads to an infinity-edge pool, spa and outdoor cooking area, taking advantage of the one. 33-acre site. The house was first built in 1973 and renovated back in 2007. After DeSick took over, he helped usher the design of the two-story house into the 21st century. The home's neutral palette represents DeSick's ever-changing taste in home decor. From colorful to gray to white and now white with some black to offset it. Although he admits that if he had a ski house, I'd want it to be cozier, not as cold and minimal. Disick's home is notably absent of color, with the exception being his daughter Penelope's bedroom which is done in pink. There's also a piece from Damien Hurst's Medicine Cabinet series featuring a blue and orange pill. I have more art, but I had to take it off the walls because it was too much, he explained. As far as the infinity pool, DeSick said that he spent the time and money making it absolutely perfect. It's almost like a hotel back there. I feel like I could take away things, DeSick admits. I just feel like it might have a little too much, but now it's hard. When you have a bunch of kids, you've gotta have a bunch of stuff everywhere. One of the most unique features of DeSick's home is the view, a rarity for the Hidden Hills area. There are a lot of gorgeous homes in Hidden Hills, but most of them back up to a hillside and don't have any kind of view, whereas my house has a view like you'd see in Bel Air or Beverly Hills. It's very rare, 